Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we have come up with top 100 MCQs on stored grain insect pest. These MCQs will be most helpful for most of the agri-competitive exams like FCI, FSSAI, IBPS AFO, ICAR JRF, MCAER, BHU, to name a few. So without wasting our time, let's start the video. Question number 1. Storage pests generally reduce dash content of the food grains. The options are carbohydrate, protein, fat or vitamin. The correct answer is option B, protein. So, storage pests generally reduce protein content of food grains. Question number 2. Rice we will pupate in dash. The options are inside the grain, in silk webbings, in silken cocoon or inside cracks and crevices. The correct answer is option A inside the grain. So rice we will pupate inside the grain. The rice weevil female makes a small hole on the grain, deposits an egg, the grub feeds inside the grain, pupates there itself and emerges through an irregular hole made on the grain. Question number 3. Atta formation is the main symptoms of dash, damage by which infestation in the go down can be easily detected. The options are rust, red flower beetle, lesser grain borer, anguimus grain moth or khapra beetle. The correct answer is option B, lesser grain moth. So, atta formation is the main symptom of lesser grain borer, damage by which infestation in the go down can be easily detected. Question number 4. Lesser grain border is most serious in which conditions? The options are hot and humid condition, cool and humid condition, cool and dry condition or hot and dry condition. The correct answer is option D. Hot and dry condition. So lesser grain border is most serious in hot and dry condition. Question number 5. Storage pest commonly found in broken cereals and their milled products. The options are pulse beetle, lesser grain border, almond moth or rust red flower beetle. The correct answer is option D, rust red flower beetle. So storage pest commonly found in broken cereals and their milled products is rust red flower beetle. Question number 6. In which of the following only grub is the damaging stage? The options are khapra beetle. Pulse beetle, confused flower beetle or rice weevil. The correct answer is option A, khapra beetle. So, in khapra beetle, only grub is the damaging stage. In case of khapra beetle, grubs are the voracious feeders. Adults are mainly involved in breeding. Whereas, both adults and larvae are the damaging stage in remaining three insects. Question number 7. The grub of lesser grain borer, Rhizopartha dominica, enters the grain after dash instar for pupation. The options are first instar, second instar, third instar or fourth instar. The correct answer is option C, third instar. So the grub of lesser grain borer enters the grain after third instar for pupation. Question number 8. In heavy infestation, which of the following storage pest turns the go-down into webbed silken mass and gives unpleasant smell? The options are cigarette beetle, khapra beetle, rice moth or almond moth. The correct answer is option C, rice moth. So in heavy infestation, rice moth is the storage pest which turns the go-down into webbed silken mass and gives unpleasant smell. Question number 9. Which of the following stored product insect pest belongs to the order Lepidoptera? The options are Khapra beetle, rice weevil, anguimanus grain moth or pulse beetle. The correct answer is option C, anguimus grain moth. So, anguimus grain moth is the stored product insect pest which belongs to order Lepidoptera. Remaining all the three belong to Coleoptera order. Question number 10. Khapra beetle hibernates in dash during grub stage. The options are grain, cracks and crevices, silk webbings or silken cocoon. The correct answer is option B, cracks and crevices. So Khapra beetle hibernates in cracks and crevices during grub stage. Question number 11. Which of the following stored grains best belong to the family Gelechidae? The options are pulse beetle, khapra beetle, 
एंग्वमस ग्रेन मॉथ और राइस मॉथ द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी एंग्वमस ग्रेन मॉथ सो एंग्वमस ग्रेन मॉथ इज द स्टोर्ड ग्रेन पेस्ट विच बिलोंग्स टू द फैमिली गैलेसिडे वेर एज पल्स पीतल बिलोंग्स टू द फैमिली ब्रूकडे खपरा पीतल बिलोंग्स टू द फैमिली डर्मिस्टिडे एंड राइस मॉथ बिलोंग्स टू द फैमिली पायरालीडे Question number twelve. One aluminium phosphide tablet is of dash grams. The options are one gram, two gram, three gram, or four gram. The correct answer is option C, three grams. So one aluminium phosphide tablet is of three gram. It releases one gram phosphine gas. Question number thirteen. The stored grain pest having great quarantine importance worldwide is dash. The options are copra beetle. Dust red flower beetle, anguimus grain moth, or saw tooth beetle. The correct answer is option A, copra beetle. So the stored grain pest having great quarantine importance worldwide is copra beetle. Question number fourteen. Stored storage pest that also feeds on animal products such as dead mice, dried blood, and dried insect is dash. The options are copra beetle. Fig moth, saw tooth beetle, or flat grain beetle. The correct answer is option A, copra beetle. So, storage pest that also feeds on animal products such as dead mice, dried blood, and dried insect is copra beetle. Question number fifteen. In saw tooth beetle, the thorax part has six saw tooth-like projections. Hence, the name given belongs to the family dash. The options are anobidae. Carculionidae, Sylvanidae, or Gelichidae. The correct answer is option C, Sylvanidae. So, in saw-tooth beetle, the thorax part has six saw-tooth-like projections. Hence, the name given belongs to the family Sylvanidae. Question number sixteen: The storage insect which can survive exceptionally at higher temperature and low humidity is dash. The options are rice weevil, red rust flower beetle, copra beetle, or Indian meal moth. The correct answer is option C, copra beetle. So the storage insect which can survive exceptionally at high temperature and low humidity is copra beetle. Question number seventeen: Which of the following is external feeder? The options are red flower beetle, rice moth, cigarette beetle, or all of the above. The correct answer is option D, all of the above. So, all the three, which includes red flower beetle, rice moth, and cigarette beetle, are external feeder. Question number eighteen: Larvae of anguimus grain moth, Cytotroga cerealella, only attacks on whole cereals. Greatest damage occurs in the dash grains in storage. The options are middle layer, upper layer, bottom layer, or all of the above. The correct answer is option B, upper layer. So larvae of anguimus grain moth only attacks on whole cereals. Greatest damage occurs in the upper layer grains in storage. Question number nineteen: Copra beetle is native to Dash. The options are Europe, India, China, or Burma. The correct answer is option B, India. So, copra beetle is native to India. Question number twenty: Indian meal moth, Plodia interpunctella, commonly called as Dash. The options are weevil moth, pantry moth, flower moth, or all of the above. The correct answer is option D, all of the above. So, Indian meal moth is commonly called as weevil moth, or pantry moth, or flower moth. Question number twenty-one: The larvae of Indian meal moth, Plodia interpunctella, is commonly known as Dash. The options are weevil worm, pantry worm, flower worm, or wax worm. The correct answer is option D, wax worm. So, the larvae of Indian meal moth is commonly known as wax worm. Question number twenty-two: Primary feeders damage dash grains. The options are sound grains, broken grains, only cereals or only millets. The correct answer is option A, sound grains. So primary feeders damage sound grains. Question number twenty-three: Dash is widely used for rearing and mass breeding of natural enemies such as Corsaira trichogramma species in the laboratory. The options are sawtooth beetle, rice moth, almond moth. Or pulse beetle. The correct answer is option B, rice moth. So rice moth is widely used for rearing and mass breeding of natural enemies such as Corsaira trichogramma species in the laboratory. 
question number 24 dash are also called as bran bugs the options are primary feeders secondary feeders young ones of primary feeders or none of the above the correct answer is option b secondary feeders so secondary feeders are also called as bran bugs question number 25 presence of irregular holes of 1.5 mm diameter on grains of rice, sorghum, wheat, barley, maize in storage is due to attack by dash. The options are khabra beetle, rice weevil, anguimus grain moth or rice moth. The correct answer is option B, rice weevil. So, presence of irregular holes of 1.5 mm diameter on grains of rice, sorghum, wheat, barley, maize in storage is due to attack by rice weevil. Question number 26, which is the internal feeder? The options are pulse beetle, rice moth, rice weevil or both A and C. The correct answer is option D, both A and C. So both pulse beetle and rice weevil are the internal feeders. Question number 27, the word silo is derived from the dash word cirros, which means pit for holding grain. The options are Roman, Latin, Greek or French. The correct answer is option C, Greek. So, the word silo is derived from the Greek word cirros, which means pit for holding grains. Question number 28, which type of silos are mostly used today? The options are tower silos, bunker silos, bag silos or all of the above. The correct answer is option D, all of the above. So, all the three tower silos, bunker silos and bag silos are mostly used today. Question number 29, a storage facility for grain or sometimes animal feed or a fertile grain growing region is called as dash. The options are godowns, silos, granary or bins. The correct answer is option C, granary. So a storage facility for grains or sometimes animal feed or a fertile grain growing region is called as granary. Question number 30. Which of the following store grain pest produce pungent smell in godown? The options are khapra beetle, rice moth, rust red flower beetle or lesser grain borer. The correct answer is option C, rust red flower beetle. So, rust red flower beetle is the store grain pest which produces pungent smell in godown. Question number 31. What is the maximum storage period of food grains in rural go-downs? The options are 2 months, 6 months, 10 months or 12 months. The correct answer is option C, 10 months. So, 10 months is the maximum storage period of food grains in rural go-downs. Question number 32. Which of the following pest occurs in both field and storage? The options are khapra beetle, rice moth, potato tuber moth or saw tooth beetle. The correct answer is option C, potato tuber moth. So potato tuber moth is the pest which occurs in both field and storage. Question number 33. Small sized rural go down capacity is dash. The options are 50 metric ton to 250 MT, 500 MT to 2000 MT, below 2000 MT or above 2000 MT. The correct answer is option A 50 MT to 250 MT. So small sized rural go down capacity is 50 MT to 250 MT, whereas medium sized rural go down capacity is 500 MT to 200 MT, and large sized rural go down capacity is above 2000 MT. Question number 34 Bad odor feeding symptom in flour is due to dash. The options are lesser grain border, cockroach. Khapra beetle or pulse beetle, the correct answer is option B, cockroach. So, bad odor feel, feeding symptom in flour is due to cockroach. Question number 35. One aluminium phosphide tablet releases dash grams phosphine gas. The options are 1 gram, 2 gram, 3 gram or 4 gram. The correct answer is option A, 1 gram. So, one aluminium phosphide tablet releases 1 gram of phosphine gas. Question number 36. Severe infestation of dash insect turns flour grayish and moldy. The options are khapra beetle, potato tuber moth, rust red flower beetle or drug store beetle. The correct answer is option C, rust red flower beetle. So severe infestation of rust red flower beetle insect turns flour grayish and moldy. Question number 37. Sweet potato beetle belongs to family dash. The options are brucidae. Anobidae, Dermistidae or Apionidae. The correct answer is option D. Apionidae. So sweet potato beetle belongs to the family Apionidae. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी एट अर्दिंग अप इन पोटैटो कॉप हेल्प टू अवॉइड डैश ऑफ द ट्यूबर मॉथ द ऑप्शन आर प्यूपेशन ओवी पोजिशन हबिनेशन स्टेज और शेल्टर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी ओवी पोजिशन सो अर्दिंग अप इन पोटैटो कॉप हेल्प टू अवॉइड ओवी पोजिशन ऑफ द ट्यूबर मॉथ क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी नाइन साइंटिफिक नेम ऑफ ग्रेन माइट इज डैश द ऑप्शन आर ट्राइबोलियम कैस्टनम लेथेटिकस ओराइजे एकेरस सेरो और एफेस्टिया कॉटला द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी एकेरस सेरो सो साइंटिफिक नेम ऑफ ग्रेन माइट इज एकेरस सेरो क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी द डैमेज बाय स्टोर्ड ग्रेन फेस्ट मेनली डिपेंड्स ऑन डैश द ऑप्शन आर मॉइस्चर कंटेंट ऑफ ग्रेन्स अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ ऑक्सीजन इन स्टोरेज डेवलपमेंट ऑफ टेम्परेचर ग्रेडियंट और ऑल ऑफ द अबव द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी ऑल ऑफ द अबव सो द डैमेज बाय स्टोर्ड ग्रेन फेस्ट मेनली डिपेंड्स ऑन ऑल विच इज मॉइस्चर कंटेंट ऑफ ग्रेन्स अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ ऑक्सीजन इन स्टोरेज एंड डेवलपमेंट ऑफ टेम्परेचर ग्रेडियंट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी स्टोर ग्रेन पेस्ट मेंबर ऑफ गैलेचरे फैमिली इज और आर टैश द ऑप्शन ऑफ पोटैटो ट्यूबर मॉथ ट्रोगोडर्मा ग्रेनेरियम एंग्विमस ग्रेन मॉथ और बोथ ए एंड सी द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी बोथ ए एंड सी सो स्टोर ग्रेन पेस्ट मेंबर ऑफ गैलेचरे फैमिली आर पोटैटो ट्यूबर मॉथ एंड एंग्विमस ग्रेन मॉथ क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी टू द फार्मर्स कीपिंग द प्रोड्यूस इन द गोडाउन शैल बी एलिजिबल टू अवेल ऑन हाइपोथिक Question of produce up to dash percentage of the value of produce pledged. The options are twenty five percent, fifty percent, seventy five percent, or eighty percent. The correct answer is option C, seventy five percent. So the farmers keeping the produce in the go downs shall be eligible to avail on hypothecation of produce up to seventy five percent of the value of produce pledged. Question number forty three. Silos are used on large scale for the bulk storage of which of the following? The options are oil seeds and cereals, beans, cotton of roots. The correct answer is option A, oil seeds and cereals. So silos are used on large scale for the bulk storage for oil seeds and cereals. Question number forty four. Cetotroga cerealella is commonly known as anguimus grain moth as it was first described from Dash province anguimus in 1736 the options are french german dutch or brazilian the correct answer is option a french so cetotroga cerealella is commonly known as anguimus grain moth as it was first described from the french province anguimus in 1736 Question number forty-five. Delta methrin is a dash. The options are grain fumigant, grain protectant, repellent, or all of the above. The correct answer is option B, grain protectant. So delta methrin is a grain protectant. Question number forty-six. Rice weevil belongs to order dash. The options are Coleoptera, Lepidoptera, Hymenoptera, or Hemiptera. The correct answer is option A, Coleoptera. So Rice weevil belongs to the order Coleoptera. Question number forty-seven: Leaving large cavities and emergence holes is sign of dash. The options are rice moth, Indian meal moth, rice weevil, or cigarette beetle. The correct answer is option C, rice weevil. So, leaving large cavities and emergence holes is the sign of rice weevil. Question number forty-eight. Pulse beetle pupates dash. The options are in silken cocoon, inside seed, outside seed, or in silken webbin. The correct answer is option B, inside seed. So pulse beetle pupates inside seed. Question number forty-nine. Fungal or bacterial infection is observed after the attack of dash insect. The options are pulse beetle, sweet potato weevil, potato tuber moth, or khapra beetle. The correct answer is option C, potato tuber moth. So, fungal or bacterial infection is observed after the attack of potato tuber moth insect. Question number fifty: Lesser grain borer is a dash flyer. The options are weak. Borers cannot fly. Depends upon the temperature or strong flyer. The correct answer is option D, strong flyer. So, lesser grain borer is a strong flyer. Question number fifty one: Which of the following is an underground storage? structure the options are kothas or kothis khatti puri or gola the correct answer is option b khatti so khatti is an underground storage structure question number 52 which of the following is a rodenticide of botanical origin the options are red squirrel 
strike nin both a and b or none the correct answer is option c both a and b so red squirrel and strike nin is a rodenticide of botanical origin question number 53 which of the following refers the property of bromodiolone poison the options are slow acting poison anticoagulant multi dose poison or all of the above the correct answer is option d all of the above so all the three which is slow acting poison anticoagulant and multi dose poison refers the property of bromodiolone poison question number 54 the droppings are spindle shaped in dash the options are roof rat mouse norway rat or none the correct answer is option a roof rat so the droppings are spindle shaped in roof rat question number 55 pusa bin is used for control of dash the options are cetophilus trogoderma rhizopertha or callosubrucus the correct answer is option b trogoderma so pusa bin is used for control of trogoderma question number 56 hidden infestation can be detected by dash the options are staining method koh method ninhydrin method or all of the above the correct answer is option d all of the above so hidden infestation can be detected by staining method or koh method or ninhydrin method question number 57 the only stored grain pest of groundnut which attacks both kernels and pods is dash the options are caradon ceratus tribolium species corsaira cephalonica or none of the above the correct answer is option a caradon ceratus so the only stored grain pest of groundnut which attacks both kernel and pods is caradon ceratus which is known generally as the groundnut brucid or groundnut borer question number 58 the first case of insecticide resistance in india in storage grain pest was that of dash the options are tribolium castanum caradon ceratus rhizopertha dominica or trogoderma granarium the correct answer is option a tribolium castanum so the first case of insecticide resistance in india in storage grain pest was that of tribolium castanum insecticide resistance in india is Storage grain pest was first reported in flower beetle Tribolium castanum in 1971 against DDT and Malathion. Question number 59 For safe storage moisture content of seeds should be dash the options are 10%, 7 to 8%, 11% or 12%. The correct answer is option B 7 to 8%. So for safe storage moisture content of seeds should be 7 to 8%. Question number 60 Zinc phosphide is dash poison the options are slow anticoagulant acute or mild poison the correct answer is option C acute so zinc phosphide is acute poison zinc phosphide is an inorganic compound that combines phosphorus with zinc it is used in rodenticide baits when an animal eats the bait the acid in the animal stomach turns the zinc phosphide into phosphine phosphine is a very toxic gas and these are used as fumigants in stored grain question number 61 maximum of stored grain pest belongs to order dash the options are coleoptera lepidoptera hymenoptera or hemiptera the correct answer is option a coleoptera so maximum of stored grain pest belongs to the order coleoptera question number 62 example of primary internal feeder of stored grain is dash the options are rice moth rice weevil red rust fly beetle or fig moth the correct answer is option b rice weevil so example of primary internal feeder of stored grain is rice weevil question number 63 which of the following range of temperature in storage accelerates the development of stored grain pest the options are 10 to 20 degree celsius 20 to 40 degree celsius 45 to 55 degree celsius or 8 to 10 degree celsius the correct answer is option b 20 to 40 degree celsius so 20 to 40 degree celsius is the range of temperature in storage which accelerates the development of stored grain pest question number 64 scientific name of lesser grain borer is dash the options are rhizopertha dominica trogoderma granarium cetophilus oryzae or lasioderma sericorne the correct answer is option a rhizopertha dominica scientific name of lesser grain borer is rhizopertha dominica question number 65 pigidium is related with dash the options are sawtooth beetle 
பல்ஸ் பீட்டில் ரைஸ் வீவல் ஆர் லெஸ் கிரெயின் போர்டர் தி கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் இஸ் ஆப்ஷன் பி பல்ஸ் பீட்டில் ஸோ பிகிடியம் இஸ் ரிலேட்டட் வித் பல்ஸ் பீட்டில் இன் பல்ஸ் பீட்டில் எலைட்ரா டு நாட் கவர் த அப்டமின் கம்ப்ளீட்லி விச் இஸ் கால் ஆஸ் பிகிடியம் question number 66 infestation of most of the insect pest can be avoided if the moisture content is below 9% except dash the options are lesser grain borer khapra beetle rice weevil or pulse beetle the correct answer is option b khapra beetle so infestation of most of the insect pest can be avoided if the moisture content is below 9% except khapra beetle question number 67 pulse beetle prefers dash the options are whole pulse split split pulse both a and b or broken pulse the correct answer is option a whole pulse so pulse beetle prefers whole pulse pulse beetle prefers whole pulse and not split pulse question number 68 value depreciation of a product owing to the present of insects or other foreign matter is called dash the options are impurity losses dockage or infestation the correct answer is option c dockage so value depreciation of a product owing to the present of insects or other foreign matter is called dockage question number 69 dash is the shortest insect among all stored grain pests the options are red rust fly beetle flat grain beetle rice weevil or lesser grain borer the correct answer is option b flat grain beetle so flat grain beetle is the shortest insect among all stored grain pest question number 70 irregular holes on the grain is related with dash the options are almond moth lesser grain borer rice weevil or rice moth the correct answer is option b lesser grain borer so irregular holes on the grain is related with lesser grain borer Question number 71 powdery grains and foul smell is related with dash the options are indian meal moth red flower beetle anguimus grain moth or pulse beetle the correct answer is option b red flower beetle so powdery grains and foul smell is related with red flower beetle question number 72 the damaging stage of anguimus grain moth is dash the options are adult caterpillar both or none the correct answer is option b caterpillar so the damaging stage of anguimus grain moth is caterpillar question number 73 rice moth belongs to the order dash the options are hymenoptera hemiptera coleoptera or lepidoptera the correct answer is option d lepidoptera so rice moth belongs to the order lepidoptera question number 74 grains are often covered with scales shed in case of dash infestation the options are indian meal moth red flower beetle anguimus grain moth or rice moth the correct answer is option c anguimus grain moth so grains are often covered with scales shed in case of anguimus grain moth infestation question number 75 the maximum damage done by rice weevil in the month of dash the options are jan to feb march to december august to october or throughout the year the correct answer is option c august to october so the maximum damage done by rice weevil is in the month of august to october question number 76 dash is the longest insect among all the stored grain pests the options are cetophila sorize cetotroga cerealella caryodon cerratus or tamarind beetle the correct answer is option c caryodon cerratus so caryodon cerratus is the longest insect among all the stored grain pest which is also known as groundnut brucket question number 77 arachnid beetle ariaceras fasciculatus is a storage pest of dash the options are arachnid coffee cocoa or all of the above the correct answer is option d all of the above so arachnid beetle Ariaceras fasciculatus is a storage pest of arachnid and coffee and cocoa. Question number 78 Impact machine which are used to kill insects in stored products are called as dash. The options are gearbox, entolators, stick trap or none. The correct answer is option B entolators. So impact machine which are used to kill insects in stored products are called as entolators. Question number 79 Chlorpyrifos methyl reldan is not effective against stored grain pest which is dash the options are khapra beetle rust red flower beetle 
सीटोफिलस और राइज और राइजोपर्था डोमिनिका द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी राइजोपर्था डोमिनिका सो क्लोरपायरिफॉस मिथाइल इज नॉट अफेक्टिव अगेंस्ट स्टोड ग्रीन पेस्ट राइजोपर्था डोमिनिका क्लोरपायरिफॉस मिथाइल इज इफेक्टिव अगेंस्ट स्टोड ग्रीन पेस्ट विच इज खपरा बीटल रस्ट रेड फ्ला बीटल एंड सीटोफिलस और राइजे बट एक्सेप्ट स्टोड ग्रीन पेस्ट राइजोपर्था डोमिनिका क्वेश्चन नंबर एटी द मैक्सिमम डैमेज डन बाय खपरा बीटल इन द मंथ ऑफ डैश द ऑप्शन आर जैन टू फेब मार्च टू दिसंबर जुलाई टू अक्टूबर और थ्रू आउट दर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी जुलाई टू अक्टूबर सो द मैक्सिमम डैमेज डन बाय द खपरा बीटल इज इन द मंथ ऑफ जुलाई टू अक्टूबर क्वेश्चन नंबर एटी वन मेजर स्टोर्ड पेस्ट ऑफ ग्राउंड नट इज द ऑप्शन आर खपरा बीटल कैरियडॉन सेरेटस ट्राइबोलियम स्पीशीज और सिटोफिलस स्पीशीज द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी कैरियडॉन सेरेटस सो मेजर स्टोर्ड पेस्ट ऑफ ग्राउंड नट इज कैरियडॉन सेरेटस विच इज द ग्राउंड नट ब्रूकेड क्वेश्चन नंबर एटी टू ओनली लावा कॉज डैमेज इन केस ऑफ डैश द ऑप्शन आर रस्ट फ्ला बीटल राइस वीवर खपरा बीटल और राइस मॉथ द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी खपरा बीटल सो ओनली लावा विच कॉज डैमेज इन केस ऑफ खपरा बीटल whereas in case of rice we will both the adult and larva cause damage question number 83 in which of the following stored grain pest infestation starts from the field itself and is carried to the go downs the options are cetophilus oryze cetotroga cerealella calosubrucus species or all of the above the correct answer is option d all of the above so in all the three which is cetophilus oryze the rice weevil cetotroga cerealella the anguimus grain moth calosubrucus species the pulse beetle the infestation starts from the field itself and gets carried to go down question number 84 potato tuber moth is controlled by egg or larvae parasitoid which is dash the options are chelonomus blackburni eocanthicona farsilata birds or chrysoperla carnea the correct answer is option a chelonomus blackburni so potato tuber moth controlled by egg or larval parasitoid chelonomus blackburni question number 85 scientific name of indian mole rat is dash the options are ratus norvegulus ratus ratus bandicota bengalensis or musbuduga the correct answer is option c bandicota bengalensis so scientific name of indian mole rat is bandicota bengalensis whereas for norway rat it is ratus norvegulus for house or common rat it is ratus ratus and for indian field mouse it is mus buduga question number 86 name a storage pest of tobacco the options are cigarette beetle tamarind beetle rhizopertha dominica or none of the above the correct answer is option a cigarette beetle so the storage pest of tobacco is cigarette beetle which is lasioderma sericorn question number 87 major grain pest prefer dash of grain the options are outer coat inner coat both a and b or embryo the correct answer is option d embryo so major grain pest prefer embryo of the grain question number 88 serious pest of dates raisins and currants is dash the options are fig moth almond moth dried currant moth or all of the above the correct answer is option d all of the above so serious pest of dates raisins and currants is fig moth almond moth and dried currant moth question number 89 phosphine gas is liberated with aluminium phosphide tablet reacts with dash the options are air moisture heat or light the correct answer is option b moisture so phosphine gas is liberated with when aluminium phosphide tablet reacts with moisture question number 90 aluminium phosphide tablets are of 3 g each what is the recommended rate of application the options are 1 tablet per 10 quintal of grains 2 tablets per 10 quintal of grains 4 tablets per 10 quintal of grains or 10 tablets per 10 quintal of grains the correct answer is option b 2 tablets per 10 quintal of grain so aluminum phosphide tablet are of 3 g each and 2 tablets per 10 quintal of grain is the recommended rate of application question number 91 the losses caused by the storage pest which includes insect fungi weeds rodents and abatic factors are about dash the options are 10% 20% 30% or 40% the correct answer is option a 10% so the losses caused by the storage pest which includes insect fungi feeds 
rodents and abiotic factors are about 10 percent question number 92 minimum exposure period of fumigation in go down is dash the options are 20 days 10 to 12 days 12 to 15 days or 5 to 7 days the correct answer is option d 5 to 7 days so minimum exposure period of fumigation in go downs for empty go downs it is 5 to 7 days question number 93 rice moth dash stage affects stored products the options are egg larvae pupa or all the correct answer is option b larvae so rice moth larvae stage affects stored products caterpillar alone is responsible for damage it prefers partially damaged grains and feed question number 94 which of the following is external feeder the options are red flower beetle saw tooth beetle cigarette beetle or rice moth the correct answer is option d rice moth so rice moth is the external feeder whereas red flower beetle saw tooth beetle and cigarette beetle are internal feeders question number 95 Potato tuber moth is one of the introduced pest into our country from dash the options are Italy Europe Mexico or China the correct answer is option A Italy so potato tuber moth is one of the introduced pest into our country from Italy question number 96 damaging stage of potato tuber moth is dash the options are adult moth caterpillar or grub the correct answer is option c caterpillar so damaging stage of potato tuber moth is caterpillar the caterpillar acts as a leaf miner in field boring into the petiole and main shoots and at later stages attacks underground tubers question number 97 damaging stage of sweet potato weevil is dash the options are adult grub caterpillar or both a and b the correct answer is option d both a and b so damaging stage of sweet potato weevil is both adult and grub the grub bore into the stems of vines and also into the tubers in the field as well as in storage feeding on the inner contents and spoiling them the adult weevil also feeds on leaves vines and tubers Question number ninety-eight: Sweet potato weevil lay eggs in or on dash. The options are leaves, tubers, vine, or both B and C. The correct answer is option D, both B and C. So, sweet potato weevil lay eggs on tubers and vines. So, the grub pupates inside larval burrow in vine or tuber. Weevil emerges after seven to ten days. Total life history takes about four to six weeks. Question number ninety nine. Sweet potato weevil commonly occurs in dash. The options are dry condition, wet condition, irrigated condition, or all of the above. The correct answer is option A, dry condition. So sweet potato weevil commonly occurs in dry condition. Question number hundred. Most serious pest on processed food is dash. The options are rice moth, capra beetle, Indian meal moth, or rust red flower beetle. The correct answer is option D. rust red flower beetle so most serious pest on processed food is rust red flower beetle that was all thank you friends for watching our video hope you find it useful please subscribe to our youtube channel for more such videos thank you